Breakfast with Jesus, Series 2, is the early bird that gets the word. How wonderful to spend the start of the day thinking about what our Lord Jesus has to say to us, reflecting on His promises and on His presence with us. May this be your blessed experience in the coming days. Where there is God, there is hope. Breakfast with Jesus, hope. Hear the word of the Lord. Romans 8, 24 For in this hope we were saved But hope that is seen is no hope at all Who hopes for what they already have? Romans 8, verse 24 This morning we want to entertain the thought Is it too much to want to hope for more or better? Should we not just be satisfied with our lot in life? and continue the relentless monotony without a second thought? For this, we are grateful for input from one of the foremost Christian thinkers and writers, C.S. Lewis. In quotes on hoping for something more, he expounds to our benefit. Most people, if they had really learned to look into their own hearts, would know that they do want and want acutely something that cannot be had in this world. There are all sorts of things in this world that offer to give it to you, but they never quite keep their promise. At present, we are on the wrong side of the door. We discern the freshness and purity of morning, but they do not make us fresh and pure. We cannot mingle with the pleasures we see, but all the pages of the New Testament are rustling with the rumour that it will not always be so. Someday, God willing, we shall get in. We will put on glory, that greater glory of which nature is only the first sketch. Yes, when God breathed life into our soul, He placed eternity in our heart. Something inside us constantly yearns for the permanent and indestructible. Time and pain will fade away but our real person will be fully revealed. The promise is that when we see Him, we shall be like Him. It will surely come. Quotation from Michael Ramsden. This is why faith is talked about as the substance of things not seen and the evidence of things hoped for. Both words carry with them a sense of reality our hope is not wishful thinking. It is saying that we know we can trust God because of who He is and the promises He has made. Let us now pause for personal reflection. Thank you, Jesus, for the cross. 
Breakfast with Jesus, this is Andrew Gold.